Buddy, welcome to another Only in Japan Go live stream. This time, we're going to be taste testing this. This is an apple pie Kit Kat. It's brand new. It just came out like 48 or 72 hours ago. That sounds better than three days ago. <laughs> and we're gonna try it. But wait, there's more. In order to really authenticate this, we have to break this down and try this and compare it against real Japanese apple pie, a really famous shop that me and Kanai, who's over there, do you see her? There's Kanai waiting for us. She's got the apple pie, I have the Kit Kats. I hope you're ready, cause this is gonna be a lot of fun. I'm so excited. Now these Kit Kats are, um, they cost about $3 for a bag. And uh, how many are in here? 12 mini Kit Kats. Now Japan is famous for the Kit Kats because that word kitokato, to Japanese students, it sounds like success. So Japanese students will eat Kit Kats before they have an exam, hoping that eating something that sounds like success would uh, help them with their grades. But it also helps Nestle, who's the creator of Kit Kats, with their own success. So Nestle has capitalized on this and made hundreds, if not thousands, of different kinds of Kit Kats. There's actually an Apple Kit Kat already, but it's not like this. This looks good. So, let's go meet Kanai, who has the apple pie. We're sitting in a nice place in the center of Tokyo in Hibiya Park. Do you have the apple pie? How you doing? The apple pie, me sit kudasai. Show us that. Oh, that's just This is called Ringo. Ringo means apple in Japanese, and we can tell it's a high quality product because. Oh wow, that looks so good. Yeah. Alright, this is what the Kit Kats are up against. Show us the inside. I'll get the good side. Whoa! Only for winter? Oh no, winter. Awesome. Um, okay. Yeah, this is Ichijiku, which is a fig, but we have an apple pie. One apple pie cost four dollars, which is more than one entire bag. We Nosh, we know that that's a fig. We just we we're just kind of yeah. Don't open it yet, can I? But it's still warm. So these are yakitate, just out of the oven, warm apple pies. There's two in there, so it costs us 800 yen or $8. So thank you, thank you. We already got some super chats that covered that. Thank you so much. And we're gonna be opening this and trying it out. But first, this is all about the Kit Kat. I mean, can a bag of Kit Kat, which is $3, it costs less than just one of these, defeat in a taste test, warm apple pie, Japanese style. So let's try it out here. All right, Kanai, you are now going to film Okay. Okay. So you're gonna I, keep I pot, un, right? Yeah, unbox this. Okay. Right. Now this this is actually for Halloween. Mm -hmm. Um, it's something that's released for Halloween. So you can see on the back the Halloween. Halloween in here. Blake. Yeah. And right here, apple pie aji, and it's being held by a ghost hand. And you can pan down a little bit. There you go. Okay. <laughs> Apple pie. Apple pie. <laughs> Alright. Oh wait, there's like a message on all of them. Oh yeah. They're all kind of different. Uh, it's Halloween character? No. <laughs> yeah, they're like Halloween characters, so that's kind of neat. I like happy. this. It's happy. Here. It's cute. It's cute. Yeah. All right. All right. Let's open this up. Oh, and on the back, for students, there's a place where you can write a message, mm. actually. A lot of people don't know that, but you can write love or your name on it. Yeah. Nobody Joan. knows that, though. Nobody knows. Did you do, do you do that, Kanai? No. <laughs> it's purple. I can smell it. You can smell it? Yeah. Whoa. There you go. Kit Kat. It's purple. Yeah. Oh, it's so good. <laughs> it's so good smelling. All right. So we got this here. Um, that's what it looks like when we broke it apart. Mm. They're minis, okay? So they're not as big. I'm going to try it right now. Kanai, you're going to hold off because we're going to do it on bias with you. Okay. That's really 
good. What? I gotta, I gotta see the. I know the audio isn't the audio isn't the same from the look at this. Do you like it? They've put in. I don't know how they've done this. They've put in a little bit of tart, like um, as though you're eating a piece of the apple. There's a there's a sweetness, but there's a little bitterness to apples, like somewhere in the back. And somehow, through their chemical magic, they've put in an apple taste, and then some kind of I don't know what it is. It tastes really like apple pie. This is really cool. All right, can I? Why don't you try this one here? Okay. Just, just we'll just try one because it's it's all about the Kit Kat. And she doesn't really like Kit Kats. Oh. So. Is that the is that the best oh. you can do? How yeah. good is it? So I'm on a scale of one to ten. On one to ten, is it like six, ten? Ten is very good, zero is awful. It's seven! Seven! <laughs> and a regular Kit Kat. Um, eight. Eight. What? <laughs> so I wait. Green, green tea flavor. All right, so she likes the green yeah, tea flavored Kit Kat. It's very apple pie. Yeah. It yeah. tastes like apple, then, yeah, you told me the, it's pie, biscuit inside. You did a little bit of yeah. apple. There's some kind of like real apple taste to it, mm. which is really good. Um, Chicken on biscuits writes in Japanese always get 30 flavors of Kit Kats. World is jealous. Yes, I can agree with that. Chicken on biscuits. The um, uh, Kit Kat world in Japan is large, and actually, these ones that come in the bags are a lot more affordable than the collector's boxes that you'll find at the airports. Mostly tourists will buy those, and those will cost two to three times more. Now I have a picture of, and I'm, can I can we can start we can start opening the apple pie. Yeah. Yeah. So this is the apple pie that we bought at the store. You can see at Ringo. This is inside of Hibia Midtown. There's Kanai there. They make a lot of them and they sell a lot of them and they're four dollars for one. All right. The fig ones are in yellow and the apple ones are in in white. And this is the. Uh, other apple Kit Kat that's oh, been wow. around for a while. It's not quite as good. Um, it, it has like an apple essence in it, but this is like a 700 yen or about seven dollars for this box. And there's only um, there's 12 in here as well. But it's 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 just not as good. It's yeah, not I as good. I haven't tried it before. No. Mm -hmm. But guess what? You're gonna get a chance to try the real hot apple pie. Yes. It just it just literally came out of the oven. These they churn them out real fast. All right, let's get it out right now. Unboxing. Dun, 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 Ringo pie. All right. Let's see here. Custard cream apple pie. Oh, they put custard in there. Is that cheating? Automatically, it's one because it's got custard in there. All right. It's still warm. It's still warm. Okay, I'm gonna. Open it. All right, do it. And if you want to get these pies, you can get them at Hibia Midtown, which is uh, right across from Hibia Park where we are. You can hear the uh, cicada chirping. Still kind of. Japanese summer. Oh, that smells so good. You opened it up and just bam, a waft of apple pie came up. Oh, that's nice. So these are two apple pies costing $8 total, $4 for one. Okay. All right. I get more exciting about food boxing than can I? It's still warm. And yeah. right, let me touch it. I washed my hands. I washed my hands. Oh, yeah, it's warm. Okay, that's good. All right. Do you want to go first? Me? Yeah, let's sh we'll share this one and then yeah. and then the other one will eat quietly when yeah. there aren't 600 people watching. Oh. <laughs> this is real. All right, let's just cue this up for everybody. This is real Japanese apple pie. It's the real deal. Can Kit Kat compare? Yeah, the shop was opened one year ago. Oh, this, yeah, the Ringo shop we bought this at, it's in the basement of Hibia Midtown and it opened up a little bit over a year ago, yeah. And the lines to get these are sometimes an hour long, right? Yeah, in, in the beginning, everybody waiting for 30 minutes to one hour. Yeah. They were waiting for like about an hour. And uh, it's and people would, but because you wait an hour, you would buy like like 10 of them, which is $40 of apple pie. 
but we only had to wait 30 seconds because there's nobody there yeah. this early in lucky. the afternoon. Yeah, so we're lucky. So can this compete with that? All right, can I give it a go? Okay. Hold on a second. Itadakimasu. Itadakimasu. <laughs> Aloha, George. Kanai's reactions are very subdued compared to my over-the-top American YouTuber reactions. Mm. You're basically a normal eater. Yeah, it's good. It's good? All right, show us the, show us the guts. Mm, it's up the pie. Whoa. I, oh. <laughs> show us the guts. Oh, she's getting in a little bit more. If it tastes so good, don't share with others, writes in Shazri. Mm. I can get behind that. Oh, look at the custard. No, Kanai. Yeah. Just hold it steady. Whoa, you can see the custard oozing out and there's pieces of apple on the top there. And that buttery, flaky pastry around it. This is way too good. Oh man. Yeah, this apple pie is so good. So, is it better than the Kit Kat? Be honest. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Kit Kat is chocolate. Ah. Uh, tastes the same, but yeah, similar. <laughs> so, dang. So let me just make it easy. You're saying that these are not as good as this. This is not the same as this. I can do this all day. iPhone 10s. Can you take the blur test? Yes, it can. They both they both smell really good. All right. Now here's John's turn. Okay, I can hold it. All right. It. You're gonna hold it. Just yeah, just hold it like this. Can I? I can do. All right. Can I's holding it while it looks at me. And we're gonna compare now the two. <laughs> this is where it comes down to. Does this beat this? I'm clean. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, I can eat a lot. All right. Yes. I've now done the research. I can give you a very definitive answer. That Kit Kat is darn close. Yes. That Kit Kat is really, really close. The apple pie, of course, wins. One, because it's hot. Two, because it's buttery. Oh, and it has custard. So instant bonus points on the custard. But. I, I cannot tell how close the, um, the, actually the Kit Kat, can I try them together? Together? Yeah. Just show me top it there. Okay. Look at the Halloween on it. And by the way, if you're a Daimyo supporter, I still have two more boxes available on Patreon. I'm sending can this out. It? Oh yeah. I'm sending this out to the, how am I gonna, okay. I'm sending this out to the Daimyo supporters on Patreon, so it's going to be in your box this month. So guess what? <laughs> ah, you dropped it! <laughs> okay. No, you can't eat that one. Is that three uh, seconds? Ah, oh, uh, no, you, it's, it's gone. Ugh. Uh, All right, well. well I'm so All right. Yes. <laughs> if you have a question, the answer is yes. It's, it's funny how funny how they do this okay we only have two hands yeah hold on I have an idea this is the this is the angle the angle that nobody really likes yeah. <laughs> okay All right, you have it boom hmm. Try them together. Try them together. Shock on it. Do it. Together? Do it. Yeah. Eat it. <laughs> eat it together. Now take another bite of the Kit Kat. Kit Kat. Kit Kat. <laughs> I was just having fun. <laughs> yeah. Which one's better? It's, it's 
same. <laughs> it's same. That's what I'm saying. In my when, mouth. <laughs> when you put the two together, it just, it, it's, all right. Look, all right, I'm gonna get into the really complicated details now. The Kit Kat has a sugary, sugar, sweet to, sweetness to it, and the apple pie has a more of a natural sugar sweetness to it. That's the only difference. The Kit Kat's a little bit sweeter, but the Kit Kat has an apple bite on one of your taste buds areas, and the real apple pie just melts in your mouth and your hands. So, um, I'm just gonna let her enjoy the rest of the apple pie. And, uh, yeah, I'm not eating that Kit Kat. Oh, the ants got it already. The yeah. ants of Hibia Parker eat it, enjoying the Kit yeah, Kats I now. Just chocolate. So chocolate. Yeah. The flavor is really apple pie. Yeah. They covered purple chocolate. Okay, so the yeah. wafers in. I think they put the real apple taste inside of, in between the wafers. So when you bite it, that's when the kick comes in, and the mm. chocolate around it has a really good combination of apples. Yeah. Yeah. Very, very oh. interesting. Very interesting. You really love that apple pie. Yeah. Yeah. Chicken on biscuits writes in, far from apple pie, this is a donut or pastry. <laughs> it, it could be a pastry, actually. But in Japan, apple pie is a full apple pie nobody will ever eat because it's too sweet and too much. So they try to make it bite-sized for each person. So they bake each pie in an individual pie, and it might be a pastry. But that's why I say Japanese apple pie. It's not the same as an American apple pie. Yeah, I yeah. love me some American and French apple pie. French apple pie is real good. That might be the American version of French apple pie, actually. It's got raisins in it. Oh, it's really good. Chicken on biscuits right though. Let me ship you my grandmother's apple pie from her tree. Whoa, <laughs> do not even offer. You have to come through on that one. <laughs> apple pie, that's so good. And Mr. Doss is in the house. Not gonna lie, apple pie goes really well with Asahi. Mr. Das. All right, you know what? I'm gonna show you something, Mr. Das. And one of our big supporters here. You see this event over here? This is one of these beer drinking events and it's not open yet. So can you give me a rain check and I'll come back here like tomorrow maybe? And we're just gonna, it's like, it's like $10 a beer though, but we're gonna come here and do it right. Yeah. How's that? Yeah? yeah? All right, I'm gonna pay it forward because I'm, I'm in debt already to Mr. Das. Been very very um, Asahi. He's an Asahi lover. <laughs> an Asahi lover. Yeah. All right. Awesome. We also have your Jimbo writes in. Is it a seasonal flavor? Yeah. This one is probably going to be just around till till Halloween. And I'm going to be honest with you. Kit Kats that are seasonal flavors do not last. Um, I bought like five or six extra bags of Japanese. Japanese sake Kit Kats with Sakura cherry blossom flavor because I know that they're not going to be available and now you, it's, you can't find them in stores. You'll find them on Amazon for double the price maybe or you'll find them in clearance stores right now. But these, I, I'm pretty sure that these apple pie Kit Kats will be gone by October 15th, 15 days before Halloween. It's like September 4th and Halloween stuff is already out. Actually, Christmas stuff is, is starting to come out. Costco had Christmas lights out. It's kind of weird but that's Costco. So it's usually September 1st, Halloween comes out. And then as soon as Halloween it finishes, Christmas just goes, just is everywhere. So the seasons start earlier than the seasons start in Japan. That makes sense. And uh, these Kit Kats will be gone probably in, in three weeks. So I would stock up in the next three weeks, basically. Right? The seasonal Kit Kats do not last. Shiki ga aru kare ne. There's four seasons in Japan, and Kit Kat tries to make something special for each season. Um, one of my favorites was a, a Shizuka, Shizuka orange citrus fruit that was really good that I sent out also to the to Daimyo supporters. So this apple pie looks really good, huh? It's the final part. That's you like can, all butter. You can finish it. Wait, is that, wait, hold on, stop, hold it there for a second. Is that an app piece of apple? That's real apple. Yeah. Hold it. What can I do? Yeah, all right. Okay, I'll take that. You sure? Yeah, because I can't bite quickly because I just because of, I just pull out my wisdom tooth. Oh, that's right. She had her <laughs> she had a wisdom tooth pulled yesterday. That was you know can I can I can't um, watch Walking Dead that she gets creeped up by Walking Dead the TV show. 
But yesterday when she got her wisdom tooth pulled out, she asked the dentist if she could keep it. And then when I was editing a video, she showed it to me. And I was freaked out by that. It's interesting how we're freaked out by different things, you know. Blood and guts in a, in a video, not freaked out. In real life, freaked out. Could I not freaked out by her tooth? That was weird. You're gonna pull the rest of your teeth? No. Hoka no toru no. No, I already already pull out everything. <laughs> oh, so you have all? My, I still got three in me. Yeah, it's my last. It was my last wisdom tooth. Oh, your last one? Yep. Better do it now. Yep. Better do it now. But it was scared. Yeah. I, I, she said. I, I heard a sound. Gee gee gee. <laughs> That's not usually. It's like a. That's okay. We'll take gee gee gee. That's a Japanese uh, onomatopoeia. Chicken on biscuits writes in. This winter, a new flavor called frostbite is coming. Super chilly, like antifreeze. <laughs> I bet antifreeze flavored Kit Kats. There'd be some people who would. I, I would actually try it because you figure if it's Kit Kat, it's just flavored like it, which means I would never drink it. But this would be a chance to taste it. So who who at Kit Kat or Nestle actually drank the antifreeze to know what it tastes like? That that's my return question to you, Mr. Chicken. Chicken on biscuits. So it's some really good questions. Um, can I stay here for just one minute? I'm gonna show people a little bit of Hibia Park. I can enjoy, it. enjoy this in peace. Don't eat the other one. Do not eat the other one. All right. Do not eat the other one. If the video is buffering a little bit, push the refresh button on the live streams. It usually does, uh, it usually fixes it. So I'm gonna take you right now and show you what the event looks like. And I want you to join me in the next live stream when we come back here tomorrow. And um, I'm just going to try a lot of different foods. This is a beer festival. Autumn is here in Japan. Once September 1st hits, it's still hot doesn't matter it's autumn that's Japan and this is I'm, I'm gonna sh just show you a little bit of what's to come for tomorrow I would say it's gonna be an awful time for the for the United States and a pretty good time for the rest of the world <laughs> because if I come here at like 7 <laughs> if I come here at like uh, 7 p.m. that's like 6 a.m. in New York and I don't even want to say with the time in California all right here it is guys you can already see behind me. They've decked it out. So, Mr. Das, you will get your wish. And it, won't, it will be more than Asahi. And this year they have an American barbecue company called Urban Barbecue. You see that? So, it looks like they got a really good barbecue action going on. It's just like Oktoberfest. Yeah. And there's the Hibia Park water fountain. And they put tables all around it going to be completely filled but if I come here a little bit early I'm going to be able to stake out a good good spot and if I bring a friend or two maybe I'll give PVG a call we're going to have a really good time here's one from uh, Belgium and a Corona well this is just like potpourri here it's a weird mix but the food looks pretty good but it's expensive that's that's about $28 for this and uh, eight dollars for those two sausages. So, mas. Ashita kara de sho? Ah, kyo kara? Ah, yoji kara? Oh, ja matta kimas. He told he told me it starts today at four p.m. Wow. Um, straight ahead in front of me is uh, a very. It's a building that's always here. And this is Hibia Park, and right there is it's a famous curry rice restaurant. I believe it's all you can eat. I don't remember, but um, I came here once before, but the line was 40 minutes to get in. So I decided not to I decided not to uh, wait there. I went somewhere else for lunch. But it's pretty neat that this place exists in the middle of Hibia Park. They have the generators for the event. They also have live music that's starting. <laughs> so it should be a lot of fun. Um, I will take a couple of questions. And if you like these seasonal Kit Kat uh, comparisons with the real thing, please click the like button. I'm going to ask Kanai one more time. We're going to eat it and then just kind of... Uh... Oh, somebody's, somebody's talking to Kanai. What happened? Ah, oh, there he is. 
Uh oh, I better get up there. We need some more likes. We need some more likes. So we'll tr we're, we'll try some of these Kit Kats if you support the channel and tell me that you like this stuff. Oh, hello. <laughs> Oh. He just listened here. Oh, you watching? No, 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 no. Oh, just hanging out. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. Where are you from? Texas. All right. Oh, yeah, so. oh very good. Do you want a Kit Kat? Oh, it's a brand new flavor, apple pie. What is it? It's a apple pie flavored Kit Kat. Oh, that's pretty cool. It just thank came you. out. It just came out. Uh, yes, two days ago. Two days ago. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Are you uh, out here streaming for... Yeah, I'm a YouTuber. That's what YouTuber? I do. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, go around the country introducing stuff. That's pretty cool. How long have yeah. you been doing that? Six years now. Six years? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Where's the, where have you been? Everywhere. In Japan? <laughs> Everywhere. Does it taste like apple pie? 50 50! Oh! What? That's crazy. A little bit. A little bit. They, they like a cold apple pie. Yeah, yeah. they yeah. added something in it that makes you <laughs> touch it like another part of your taste buds or something. Nestle. It's so good. <laughs> <laughs> it's so good. Awesome. So that's all we got for you. If you have any questions, you can uh, leave a comment below. If you do like these Kit Kats or these food unboxings, click the like button. That's how we know if you like it. And uh, Kanai, Hi. Final, final question. Question? Yeah. Apple pie or Kit Kat? Definitive. Which one is better? Yeah, apple pie. Or apple pie Kit Kat? Apple pie. Apple pie, the real thing. Yeah. I'm gonna go, it's 50-50 it's on this one. Mm. You know why? Because that apple pie that we have here is $4 for one. Yeah. And cost performance, I can eat one of these Kit Kats. If, I bet if I microwaved it, for five seconds, it would taste like a hot apple pie. That'd be something to try out. And if we do that, then maybe it, it'll be on equal footing. But I don't know, it's like, it's slightly artificial tasting, but this is one of the closest to coming to the natural taste of apple pie that I've ever had Kit Kat do. And that's pretty impressive that they could do this in a laboratory. I like, I like hot apple pie with vanilla ice cream. So I should stick these. I should get an apple pie and just stick a bunch of Kit Kats around the app. The sorry, the ice cream. Stick a bunch of Kit Kats around like French vanilla ice cream. Like, you can get pretty creative. I bet you someone's gonna do that. I bet you someone's gonna do that. That could be for another YouTuber. You, you hear that out there, YouTubers? Time to go so wild with hot <laughs> apple pie Kit Kats. This one probably is gonna melt, get all gooey. That's the beauty of it, though. It's the beauty of it, though. All right, thanks so much. We got 300 likes. We'll be back here tomorrow for this event right here. Um, I don't know. Kanai doesn't drink alcohol. Yeah, Osake I don't no manai, drink, yeah, I don't drink alcohol. So I'll try to come with somebody who does, yeah. and then we'll experiment a little bit here at the <laughs> event because I love these Hibiya Park events. Mm -hmm. And if the weather holds out, it is pretty cloudy today in Tokyo, and the weather, the humidity has gone down a little bit. The weather can hold out. We'll be back, and uh, should be a fun live stream. I'm going. We're going to. Um, O Osaka, Kobe, and Awaji Island on this Next. yeah 16th, 17th, 18th. I'm going to Niigata on the 9th and the 10th, the 8th, 9th, and 10th. Mm. And then we're going to Fukui Prefecture, Kanai and I, because since she's joined the show, she gets opportunities to travel with me. And that's a shout out to our Patreon supporters because you also make that po possible uh, for us to travel around and do the show together. We're gonna be in Fukui on uh, August, 29, 28 and 29? 26, 26 and 27 and then we'll do probably a live stream in Kyoto as well since we have to go through Kyoto to get back to Tokyo. So it's gonna be a pretty exciting month. Um, I still got another episode on the main channel to release which is waiting. <laughs> it's been a little while. That'll be released probably if I can tonight or tomorrow. And that's it. Yeah, I would love to invite PVG. We'll see if he's, if he's up to it. Last 20 seconds enjoying a beautiful view of lovely Hibiya Park, the green and the cicada. Thank. <laughs> no, thank with half of a thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. See you next time.